funding doesn't end there. The city of Waco will also be getting $34 million to use across the city, and half of that is going straight back to the community. Six News reporter Maria Aguilera has more on what this money will be used for. The funds will be used for several things across the city. It's all part of the American Rescue Plan in which the city of Waco is receiving $34 million. They're setting aside half of that to go back into the community, and that includes affordable housing. And the American Rescue Plan is a, potentially a once in a lifetime opportunity um, for the city to do um, all the things that it's wanted to do, but it's hard to identify funding sources. The city of Waco approved the plan to use $17 million from the American Rescue Plan in three key areas after receiving feedback from the community. $4.3 million for new affordable housing, $3.1 million for home rehabilitation, and $1.8 million for down payment assistance. The categories were very broad on purpose, and so the team is working to build out specifics. One of the biggest needs? There is a definite need for affordable housing here in the city. Galen Price with the city manager's office it's says they commissioned a housing study in spring of 2021 to determine where the gaps are. With the rental market the way that it is, there is a gap between what individuals are earning and have the amount to afford versus what the actual rents are. With the study and the funds, they want to identify recommendations and strategies to close the gaps by developing a plan that's long term and sustainable. Money may be going towards the rehab of existing housing, um, helping individuals with the construction of new housing. As you know, construction prices um, have skyrocketed within the last six months. So being able to uh, build affordably um, so people can't actually afford homes. The funds will be used through 2024. By the end of this year, they'll have the results from the housing study and they expect to have an affordable housing plan in January. In Waco, Maria Aguilera, 6 News.